Roll. Thanks for joining me to chat about the recent news, the alliance between uh, Pisces and Resilience. It's it's really spectacular. We're tremendously excited to kick things off. We, we really do think that this alliance speaks directly to Pisces' mission to make all cancers curable diseases. And, and the model that we use, this bench to market to patient model, it, it's a perfect alignment and, and we're really excited. I'm super uh, thrilled and stoked about the whole uh, partnership, um, again, because it's so aligned with our own mission. So let's talk about resilience. How do you see the role of biomanufacturing bio in advancing breakthroughs to patients? And, and where did resilience come from? Yeah, so John, the company was formed, as you know, in the middle of the pandemic. Uh, and it was catalyzed by this issues that we saw with supply chains. People just also recognized that there was a general underinvestment of yeah. uh, in, in the biomanufacturing space. So while we had done amazing work in biology to come up with these curative therapies, we just hadn't kept up with the with the manufacturing. Yeah. So it was a clear need that we should build a company that would focus on this aspect of the biotechnology. So Pisces really is the highest concentration of IO expertise in the world. It's this incredible collection and really uh, forms part of this infrastructure behind a lot of the immuno-oncology discoveries that are going on. Uh, one of the huge gaps in this area really is the um, is the ability to deliver that to patients. So we see this uh, relationship with you guys as fulfilling what we think is, is the weakest link in that entire uh, chain to the patient, which is the ability to manufacture and actually deliver. So I, I can't tell you how happy you are to, to kick this off and to, uh, to work with such a great team. You have just such a robust operation as it comes to manufacturing, but I know that internally you've got a great innovation arm. And maybe could you talk a little bit about that and some of the things that our investigators uh, can work with you guys on in terms of solving problems? Right. So uh, in addition to the general like bricks and mortars of uh, laboratories and um, process development labs and GMP manufacturing, we have established this, uh, what we consider like the over the horizon technology group. We feel that this this group, uh, which uh, where I'm standing actually right now in San Diego, is going to be the one that um, can uh, work with your researchers, solve problems, um, and uh, and and create the, the bespoke solutions that are sometimes needed for the new modalities that are constantly coming out um, from our understanding of biology. But as as you think about uh, the the bed to um, uh, patient uh, philosophy, how do you see us um, helping you with that uh, with that philosophy and, and with your mission? What Pisces has in capability is is an incredible network of, of fundamental basic and translational scientists that are discovering mechanisms of action of many of our therapies, mechanisms of resistance, and then using that information to design the next generation therapies. And so to work with a partner that under one roof has vector expertise, that has manufacturing expertise, assay development, process development, this really absolutely accelerates those early phase ideas, these little proof of concept trials that we're doing right into uh, real registration clinical trials, which is we're tremendously excited about. And this is really the final proving ground, you know, is in the patients and, uh, yep. and in cures. And so this anything that can accelerate that uh, is uh, is essential. And, and this is what uh, you guys are bringing to the table. And it's a virtuous cycle. It comes right back. So both the, from the investment standpoint, feeding back into the network, because we, we, of course, are a nonprofit, and the the actual information that comes from that, you know, for our translational team and to work with you guys to study the responders versus non-responders and come back and redesign next gen therapies with the, with our informatics group, yeah. and then finally this concept of investments. You know, we've got a ton of great IP and great founders that are coming out of the Pisces network, and they're looking for partners and and they're looking for opportunities that will carry them all the way through. And these are looking for early investors that are that are there for the long run, and that they're there uh, giving not just money but real expertise. And this partnership, I think, really illustrates that. Amazing! Well, and look forward to uh, a great collaboration. Oh, thank you! It's it really is a partnership. It's a perfect match.